Generation Gap Alert. You may or may not remember Be Kind Rewind. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I remember. I was bad about it. There's an extra dollar or something I had to give every time I brought a movie back. So weird, right? Like, that is so far in the past. Technology has made so much forward movement since the days of video stores on the corner. I'm kind of looking at a little of the history. So, Blockbuster. It was originally something else, wasn't it? 19 years ago, it hit its peak with 9,000 locations around the world. Wow. And then, poof, people didn't rewind. (laughs) And so it went away. Blockbuster has seen a resurgence in pop culture relevance in recent years after Netflix produced and released a season of Randall Park storing a sitcom based on the last location. Mm-hmm. It was the, the last Blockbuster. And so it was on the streamer. Uh, the last store also released a Super Bowl commercial last year. So there's some discussion like, is Blockbuster coming back? Blockbuster's owner, Dish Network, has not commented on the sudden revival of Blockbuster.com. Hmm. You can look it up. Previously said it was not franchising new locations of the former video store chain. However, could there be? And however, if you are of a certain age, you may have no idea what we're talking about. Blockbuster Video is coming back. Rent your favorite movies on VHS. VHS? Gosh, I don't think I even have a DVD player. Come into the store and browse our huge selection from Ace Ventura to Zoolander. I have to get in my car and drive? To a place? Ugh. Just be sure you'll bring it back the next day. Wait, I have to go back to the store a second time? No wonder this place closed. We're bringing back all the nostalgia like late fees. So, are you ready to rent from Blockbuster? Okay, I guess I'll take a copy of Titanic. Oh, sorry, all our copies of Titanic are out. Blockbuster Video, be kind and rewind.